Hey everybody and welcome to the Daily Scope, 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 Scopes for the 19th of March. So today we have Mercury making a set style to Pluto which is exact at 3.24am and this lasts for about a few days it will affect us. So when Mercury makes a set style to Pluto we can expect to see positive and harmonious sort of like energy. So this transit can if we want it because you know this is sort of like applied holistic um, astrology can bring a new level of understanding that can help us to make crucial decisions and don't forget as well these are based on Vedic constellational astrology not western astrology as well so based on where the planets or luminaries sun and moon or asteroids chiron are at any given time the con actual constellation that they're in so yeah the <laughs> energies of this transit can support activity involving research and investigation helping us to assess situations and make more better well-informed decisions this transit can also be beneficial for forming new partnerships and collaborations as it encourages us to communicate our thoughts and feelings more clearly and openly it can also be a good time to say ideas, put plans into action. But on the downside, transiting Mercury sets to our Pluto can bring with it an increased tendency to be controlling and manipulative. So it's good to be aware of this and ensure that we are being honest and respectful when dealing with others. While it can be tempting to manipulate others and influence others by deceptive ways it's good to remember that doing this can have negative impacts on relationships if you're not mindful additionally this influence can also bring a sense of increased paranoia and suspicion damaging relationships if left um, unchecked because you may accuse people of doing things that they're not actually doing and um some of you can also resort to controlling behaviour to get the upper hand and maintain your sense of power. But you know, force sort of control is always a losing of power. It's not real power, even though we may put others in a fearful place and they may do things because we scare them and bully them but it's not real affection it's not real love so just remember that when this happens our relationships do become toxic and unstable so to avoid doing this it's essential to take time and reflect on your behavior and make sure that you're not using your power to dominate others during the mercury set star pluto transit you can take advantage of this increased sense of intuition and awareness to help you recognize potential potential threats before they become um, dangerous as well so it kind of makes us more aware so you know don't be overly paranoid but don't ignore those red flags as well and it's also remember that Pluto brings both positive and negative energies with it so it's useful to stay mindful and use the increased awareness positively and protecting yourself from harm rather than trying to use it to deceive people and um, by being more alert to the potential issues with this energy we can you know resolve our controlling tendencies or anything else and be susceptible to lies as well being aware that you know maybe we should fact check today because of this influence as well also today the moon enters Aquarius at 5.47 um, so I've put that info in the playlist so check out the link to the playlist and um, listen to the moon in Aquarius file. Also um, Mercury makes a semi-square to um, Uranus today as well so this is exact at 16 minutes past 7 and will affect us right up until about the 23rd, 24th of March yeah so on the positive side, this transit can bring about an increased sense of um, creativity and new ideas, um, allowing us to break free from routine and explore the world around us in a new way. So it's supporting that sort of Pluto energy that I was talking about earlier. Mercury, semi-square and Uranus can also add challenging elements um, to the day, um, but also allows us to be more open-minded and to, you know, look in to new ideas which can make us more conscious of our need for freedom and change often for some of you you may feel restless and anxious um, because of this energy communication can also lack um, focus and clarity so again going back to you know for some of you it just be wrong communication for some of you people may use deceptive language
language to gaslight you and stuff like that so watch out for that because it's amplifying that energy of mercury and the negative energy of mercury textile pluto that i mentioned earlier also you know people can find it hard to adjust to any changes today so it's important to remember that this will it won't be permanent the effect of this transit but we, the best use of this energy is to be more creative and opening yourself up to you know those new ideas and experiences take on um, new risks and come out of your comfort zone as well the moon goes into void of course today at eight 55 p.m and mercury also makes a semi set star to saturn so this energy brings a sort of like carefulness and caution to the day so it allows us to you know counteract the effects of the transits that um, allow us to be open to deception and manipulation allowing us to be more practical in our thinking more organized in our actions which can be really good for our work or any personal um, side hustles or anything like that also, this energy encourages us to think our decisions through and carefully, you know, plan ahead. On the negative downside, this transit can bring about feelings of restriction and self-doubt making it difficult for us to take risks and make those um, bold moves which the Uranus energy I was talking about earlier wants us to do so we have to be mindful of any potential feelings of doubt and fear that arouse but still try and take these small steps to reach your goals even though it can be scary right now also today Jupiter semi stars Uranus so this affects us right up until about the 25th of March strongest today at 10.05 p.m so on the positive side this energy adds to the week exciting and unexpected opportunities but also some of us may get sudden bursts of inspiration and insight making us feel more liberated as well as you know giving us more optimism and allowing us to feel more enthusiastic about our life even if things are a bit crap but also negatively this energy of Jupiter semi star Uranus can bring about unexpected and unwanted changes and can increase the tendency for people to take risks impulsively or behave or say things impulsively without thinking so you know it's important to think before you do and say things because it's easier to say things but harder to take them back as well also there can be tension today and disruptions in our routines our normal routines and relationships so it's best to try and channel this energy sort of positively to help you bring about positive um, growth in your life because that's what it's all about ultimately this podcast promotes um, using astrology to help ourselves grow and to heal as well so Jupiter semi star Uranus brings with it a sense of hope optimism and also this can be just on an individual level or you know the energy is there for the collective to embrace if the collective wants to so all in all this energy wants us to move away from what's stale or what's old in our life and move towards what's new content creators can use this transit to talk about the importance of change and self-improvement urging you know your followers to take advantage of these um, transit energies or to embrace positive transformation in general for example you can discuss how we can open ourselves up to new ideas and perspectives encouraging us to become more open-minded and flexible you can also speak of the importance of taking calculated risks and embracing change and talk about you know how we can build the courage and motivation to take uh, you know those steps forward also today venus makes a parallel to the moon's north node which is exact at 11 46 tonight but also affects us right up into about the 24th 25th so the positive effects of this transit again is can bring increased financial gain or spiritual gain or any other gains increases in money and stuff like that it also brings a sense of good luck and success in relationships that can help us to repair any arguments that the other transits bring to us today making us um, find more harmony and inner peace additionally this transit may also bring a new level of insight allowing us to recognize opportunities and make better decisions as well 
regarding our future. Negatively, Venus parallel, the moon's north node may bring feelings of confusion and difficulty in understanding our current path or situation. So it's important to take note of this period. It's also necessary to take time to reflect and re-evaluate your current life choices as well. Taking this time to assess the situation properly can provide clarity and help guide decision making as well, allowing us to make better decisions. So yeah, that's the day. Scopes, 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 scopes for the 19th of March.